to my favorite bunch of beauties welcome back to the channel and welcome to monday morning makeup today i am feeling like being in my comfort zone and i have picked a lot of palettes which you have seen in my makeup basket that i have not used in a long time and one of them is the bh cosmetic sugar cone palette so this is the one that i want to use today so we are going to be neutral but um thank you all so much for joining me and my inconsistency i am looking for my fenty primer i know i pulled it there it is all right so today is a day that i am going to prime my face and we are just going to get into it so Give me one second while I zoom in. I'll be right back. All right. So I am back. And I am first going to go ahead and prime my face with the um, Fenty Pro Filter Primer. And let me just grab a brush real quick to do that with. And I want to um, apologize first of all for no video last week. I say I'm going to be consistent one week and then the next week there are no videos on this channel so bear with me this has been my mo for a minute but bear with me all right so that is done and then as always we are going to do the brows and move from there so there is reasons, and my top is missing. There are reasons why I have not, or why I did not do videos on this channel last week. And it is because I have been given an opportunity to, to do something that is right along with my goals and the dream of what I want beauty over age to become. It's been a uh, sort of part of my, uh, I guess part of my business plan from the beginning. And I am, um, I'm excited about it. Like I'm, I'm really excited about it. I am in the process of doing some training on that right now. So I don't want to speak too much about it. But it is going to be like an additional arm or just it's going to be under the umbrella of Beauty Over Age, but then a separate entity at the same time. So you all, please wish me luck. And I will be giving you more information as time goes on as to what that is going to be. But I am really excited about it. This is like a dream for me. So I'm so happy to be making it happen. And at the same time, I thank you all for your support on Beauty Over Age for all over, well, Beauty Over Age, Nisi W Beauty, all of that over the years. That kind of helped me come to the decision to do what you know what I'm going to do or make the next step that I'm going to be making but more on that later I have been putting all of my energy into that so I don't have a whole lot of energy I, 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 I have it in small batches so and then I have knee surgery coming up on December the 3rd so getting ready for that, lots of appointments and things I'm trying to get done and that I needed to get done before I actually go in for the surgery. So that is a part of, it's just been a lot. There's been a lot going on. I'm still trying to keep some kind of semblance of normalcy at the same time, but I want to keep using all these different ones without let me use this one so i'm going to put my eye base on and it is the mac paint pot in contemplative state as usual 
But yeah, we are having, not we, I am having knee replacement surgery on December the 3rd. So, yeah, it's been a lot to kind of get ready to get that done and get all the ducks in a row that I need in a row before I go out from work. I am, pray for me that it is not, I mean, I, I have a decent pain tolerance, but pray for me that the surgery goes well and that I don't have a lot of intolerable pain because I am excited to actually get this done too because this is like a quality of life issue for me. I have not been able to do a lot of the things that I like to do because of this 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 knee this knee that is bone on bone arthritis i have not been able to do things that i like to do like get outside and walk i need my where did you go oh um yeah like get outside and walk or just like um last weekend i tried like we went out um, I went out with my sisters. We had definitely a brunch and then we went to do a little bit shopping, but when I a little bit of shopping. But when I tell you that this knee was not letting me be great at all, I feel like I had to cut that shopping trip short. Cause this knee was throbbing and not wanting to go any further. So it's just stuff like that that I'm ready to be able to do again. So I am excited about the knee surgery. And let me just kind of, I'm gonna set this with some powder. We'll use our Danessa Myricks powder here. I'll just use this little, what is this? It's a highlight brush. Oh, it's a setting brush. This is my Real Cosmetics setting brush and just set this. So yeah, hopefully while I am off, um, I'll have some time to come on back here and get some videos done. Uh, don't think I'm going to overdo it because I am not. But most of my re my videos require sitting. So I think I should be able to get something like that done while I am recovering. All right. So we're going to go in with the shade Delicious just in the crease. But yeah, that is the things that are going on in my life right now. And of course, you all know I have two, I have two other channels and I think I mentioned them before, but they will always be in my um, description. So check them out if you ever get a chance. So I've been working on those as well because these are, those are like. Um, one of them is like more like the spiritual side. One of them is going to be more like the fun side. And I just want to keep those kind of separate from what I do here. So yeah, that is what has been going on lately. Oh, not to mention, if you all do not know, um, my sister and I have re- sort of relaunched our indi I mean to individuality channel. I'm gonna use this shade here too. We have relaunched our to individuality channel. Um trying to keep a little bit of consistency with that but it's hard to always do. But I'll put the link for that channel in the description as well. 
we have like a couple new videos on there if you haven't seen them already all right and this seems like this is going to be a quick eye look i need a smaller let's use this one um i am going to go in with the shade homemade which is the darkest shade in the palette and it'll be on the outer corner so i'm struggling i'm struggling because i still have the makeup academy uh course to finish also mind you it is um go at your own pace so i can finish it when um i'm ready to finish it but it's like this other thing has taken over in in level of importance for me because this other thing is sort of directly related to my business and the plans that i have for my business so that unfortunately you all is going to be put on the back burner i feel like i will finish it but i will finish it when i'm i'm sort of more prepared to finish it not to mention that i already have certification anyway in makeup artistry so this was just like an extra sort of an extra training to keep me sort of updated on new things going on in the um world of makeup and makeup artistry but yeah i just thought i would come on here and sort of spill my guts to you all during this here monday morning makeup i am happy to be doing my makeup with you all again and today i was just sort of feeling like you know how you have comfort food? I'm just doing comfort makeup. I wanted to do that and just come on and talk to you all about things that are going on because I know on this channel I'm going to be talking about those things. Just like I said, I was going to be talking about like the women's health issues on here sometimes on my channel. So I'm going to be talking about my plans going forward with my business on this channel as well. This is still such a pretty palette. So I just wanted to kind of get you all prepared with the fact that <clears throat> you all are going to be hearing about it. And I hope it doesn't bug you that you will be hearing about it. I am going to skip to my face for a moment. Yeah, I'm going to skip to my face for a moment and do my foundation. And I'm using the Kosas Revealer. And this is the shade, when does this expire? When does this expire? I don't feel like I've had this that long. But this is the shade Medium Deep Neutral Warm 340. And I'm going to spray my brush. And just think I was going to put like, put on a cream colored sweatshirt. You do not put on a cream colored sweatshirt to come on here and do makeup. Asking for trouble. I want to kind of, let me see my mirror. Because I know I put that eye base a little bit in this area. So I want to kind of blend that out. I'm trying to pay attention now to the things I do. Because then I look back at my videos and go, oh God, why didn't I? Why didn't I buff that out? Why didn't I get rid of that little raccoon look around my eyes? So I'm trying to. Pay more attention to what I am doing here. Okay. We need one more pump. Okay. 
Oh, and I want to say my birthday is on Wednesday. So I am happy about that. Not that I'm doing anything on Wednesday because I am going to be going out soon. So I'm not taking off. I'm going to work on that day. But still, it's my birthday. Alright, so I want to, I'm going to do my concealer first. And because I forgot to grab one and this one always stays in my bag, we are using the Juvia's Place. What do they call this concealer? The Juvia's Place Concealer in shade 11. And we'll just put a little bit here. We'll use one of these and just buff it out. I don't think there's anything else going on except just to say, um, I guess, um, just to say thank you to all of those who have supported my business so far. And don't forget the um, empower wear sweatshirts that I have on my site I probably will be having a Black Friday sale so be on the lookout for that oh another thing another thing that I forgot to mention that's sort of been taking me away from my channel I have a large order well it's large for me because I'm still new and I'm doing this by myself for tumblers and they are customized tumblers for a lady who's having a convention coming up. So I have been busy trying to make sure I get those tumblers done and get those tumblers done correctly. So there are only so many hours in the day to try and get stuff done. But I'm doing it. I'm getting it done. I have a few more left to do and I will be done with it. And I can send her her bill. I am going to set my face with the the, the Danessa Myricks powder. Hmm. Let's get this part off of here first. Then we can go here. So I feel like things are coming together, you all. And when you are working in your purpose, I think that is when things actually come together for you. And I think they are. So I am going to continue to hustle. I am going to continue to try and do the work that I need to do. I'm going to finish my eyes first to get this business to where I want it to be. I, let me do an eyeliner first. And it is going to be my favorite one from Melt, if I can find it. All right. So, in the midst of all of my pencils there, I cannot find my favorite eyeliner. So we're going to go with a very close second. And this is one of the um, eyeliners from Mally, the Evercolor Waterproof Eyeliners. And this one is in the shade Walnut. And we'll just put that on the waterline. I'm going to take, I think, the darkest shade from the Snow Cone palette and use that under the lower lash line. This one, this is the Sonia G Pencil Pro. So we're going to go into the shade Homemade again and just put that down here. And 
And then I'm going to take the shade Toasted and try to blow it out a little bit. I don't want it to look so stark. Okay, and then let me just kind of brush this off a bit because I'm going to use this same brush and go in with one of the metallic shades as an inner corner highlight. That's clean. And it keeps the tip a little bit wet so it can be metallic. I'm going to go in with the shade Dipped, which is this shade here. that here all right done 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 and let's not forget the mascara this time like I've been doing but I'm going to be using the bare minerals lash topia this is one of my sort of I want to say top three mascaras because it's going to be the it Cosmetics um, mascara. Then it's going to be the Lash Princess, and then it's going to be this one. All right, you all, I had to concentrate on what I was doing. You can't talk and do mascara at the same time. And I feel like I am still a little bit shiny, so I'm going to take this small setting brush again. And then I just want to go closer up under that eye and set that before I do anything else. Perfect. That little shine is gone. All right, so we are going to move on to bronzer. I have the Kosas bronzer here. And this is their... Uh, I don't know the difference. I feel like they have one in the yellow container. They have one in this container. But this is in deep, which is a warm, dark bronze shade. And I am going to take this brush here, which is the pretty much everything. Oh, no, this is not. I'm going to take this one. This is the contour brush, but I'm going to use it for my bronzer. and we will move on to blush and I think I only pulled three blushes this one might seem like it's the same color as my bronzer almost but I'm going to use this from Milani this is their baked powder blush in Coco Felicita we will take the blush brush and go lightly because we know about Milani. And then I am going to take the highlighter from Pat McGrath. And I don't know why, but I still keep this in the box. But this is the Divine Rose highlighter here. This is just a Tarte Cosmetics brush. But it seems to be the right size, so... We shall just go right along the top of here. Okay. 
And the last thing left to do other than spray my face is do my lips. And I think I am going to go with this It Cosmetics kind of confidence in a serum gloss. 90% hydration base. This one is in the shade. I wish I knew. Is it right here? Self-worth. So it looks like that. But I'm going to line my lips first with the MAC Lip Liner in Chestnut. open this for the first time and I think I have one open but all right and that is that let me just spray my face with some fix plus and that is the look for the day i am set to do the rest of my videos and i'm going to zoom out and we will be right back all right so i am back this is my look for the day we are still trying to train this puff to do what it is supposed to do but oh well thank you all so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are already subscribed, please make sure you hit that notification bell so you know when I have a new video coming out. Have a great day and don't let your day be a waste of makeup. Bye.